It's ten past five in the morning and I'm driving to get our airport. I am just putting Fallout Boy on, just for the entire way. That's where you're wrong. And on this sunny morning, I am here in the North Terminal Long Stay Car Park at Gatwick Airport. Uh, so you might be wondering, um, a few things really. Uh, <laughs> so I have decided that I'm going to weekly vlog at the moment uh, for a couple of reasons. I mean, I think at the moment, times are very weird and we've all got a lot more time on our hands so including myself so for context uh up until a few weeks ago i was a full-time uh student in my third year and i was a part-time barista and neither of those gigs are currently on full capacity right now so there's that um, I just also think it'd be interesting to document what's going on, you know, I think people will look back at this time Yeah, I just, I just think it's interesting to document and to have uh, And third and finally, and I would argue probably the biggest reasons to why I'm doing this is um, My boyfriend is going into isolation for three months So, uh, I hope he doesn't mind me putting this on the internet But uh, he, it, he takes a immunosuppressant for a condition that he has So he's from the northeast and he's moving back to the northeast in with his mum Which he hasn't lived with his mum for well over ten years um, And uh, yeah, because it's just, you know, easier for him to be taken care of in that regard Because at the moment he lives in a shared house and you know whilst i'm sure his housemates don't want him to die it's like <laughs> that sounds dramatic ah uh, this is a dramatic situation yeah it's just it's just a lot to ask housemates to do um whereas it would be easier for him to do at his mum's anyway so he's yeah moving to the other side of the country for three months at least we don't know how long that's the middle of june and it's currently the middle of march so um yeah so i thought i'd weekly vlog show you what i'm getting up to which leads me to alice why on earth are you in the uh, long stay North Terminal park car park at Gatwick? And I'm here to answer that question. Uh, so before it all well and truly kicked off, my parents and my nana went on holiday to Cuba. Very nice, lovely. I'm, I can't wait to hear about the great time that they had. Uh, they were planning on sort of making their own way back to Bristol, um, but sort of in the time that they've been away and i do want to point out that they were responsible they were taking cues from the government and you know the powers that be and at the time long-haul travel didn't seem as silly as it might now so you know my parents are responsible people um as well i want to get out there first um but yeah so in light of that um, I've come to pick them up. Getting home with like my grandmother who is almost 80 would be a task. So anyway, I'm gonna sit here and wait for my my parents and I will catch up with you when I get home. Good morning. So yesterday, as I'm sure you can probably imagine, I was super duper tired and I just came home and had to sleep and all that fun jazz. So today is Tuesday the 24th of March, so the day after the night before, we are on lockdown, baby! Um, and I am getting ready for my first online uni workshop. Gonna see how that goes. I'm also in my final year, so um, I'm never going back to uni. And it's all a bit weird. I'm, you know, trying to be glass half full about this. I'm also definitely going to be late. Like, I... The thing is, is you, you hear, oh yeah, just like log on when the time you're supposed to be there. I got in the shower and I spent far too long in there, so excellent, love that for me. I forget even what my workshop's on, you know. We'll see how this plays out. I've actually got two almost back to back. I've got like a one-on-one -on -one session with a guy running one of the workshops for my uni. I've never met him. Let's see how that goes. Um, and that's like three, whereas 
yeah, this is at half past nine till quarter past twelve. So, I mean, I'm definitely going to mute myself and make a cup of coffee whilst I'm on this thing. You know, make it work to my advantage. So I'm just looking for some concealer. Um, but yeah, yesterday was weird. So I was driving um, back from Gatwick at literally like nine o'clock. So like rush hour time on a Monday morning. And yes, there were cars and like lorries, but not driving into cent like. I have to like drive back to where you, you could get into central London to then come home. And it was, yeah. And then like, even like once I got away from London, basically once I, yeah, turned off the M25 onto the M4, like no cars, no cars. It was crazy. I've never seen it so empty. And it was strange is like, obviously what's going on is really scary i don't well i guess it is it can be but the day was really nice like it was really sunny and it's like i think i think so last weekend basically everybody and their dog went for a walk snowdonia reported their busiest weekend ever i mean one hand it's really unfortunate that people are going to like those sort of places when like not in their spare time normally but when their spare time is restricted um and they you know, the odds are a lot of people probably would have stayed home, but when they're told that the cats stay home, they definitely have to go out every five minutes, which, listen, I get it. It doesn't slap the same when you're told to do it, you know? Like, I understand. I think also in part why people did go out was because the weather has been shocking up until this weekend, and it's just like, oh, sod's law. It, it's, it's a cruel, cruel world, but here we are, guys. Anyway, I'm gonna blast my hair with a hairdryer very quickly, log in and see how this workshop goes. What's up? It's about 15 minutes later and guess what? I was the only one that turned up to that call. So we're giving it 10 minutes, we're giving it to 10 a.m. And then I think I'm getting a one-on-one -on -one tutorial. So, <laughs> <laughs> Woo! so I'm gonna make myself a cup of coffee. So let's put in a coffee making, breakfast eating, heckin' learning montage. I realized something earlier today that I'm moving in a couple of weeks and currently where I live has a balcony and where I'm moving does not and in our current state I felt like it was best to take full advantage of the next couple of weeks of both the beautiful sunshine and an outside space to call my own because I am gonna be in a top floor flat with no outdoor space so I thought I'd show you my desk for the day. Here we go, we've got a nice little, I think this is B&Q special, comes with some chairs and a fold up table, loving it. Got myself a, a cushion, here's my, my cardigan, here's, <laughs> here's our keys, Pikachu keeping us safe. Um, and yeah, this is my desk, got myself my laptop, just had another workshop on it and so far they're going okay, um, not like £9,000, this is a great spend of my time and money okay but you know okay um got my bullet journal don't mind the man rolling down the road on a lawnmower got my bullet journal got some water got the book i'm reading we're gonna talk about this later and yeah my phone just want to point out all the children in my block of flats are not social distancing they are playing tag down the bottom but you know whatever i mean they ain't my kids i'm trying to be as much glass half full as possible about this and i'm like i probably wouldn't have chose to sit outside today and do some work but i have so you know go team whilst i've got you here i'm thinking about trying to read a book a week which going from reading currently no whole book this entire year to reading you know 12 
which will be, you know, with excuse you. That's Billy the dog. But yeah, going from reading zero books to reading 12 books if we're on lockdown for 12 weeks is quite a lot, but I've got a lot of time. I'm about halfway through, but I'm going to give you a book review in these weekly vlogs for every book that I read. Fingers crossed. Anyway, yay, exciting stuff. Whoop, whoop, whoop. TGIF guys, it is now Friday evening. Um, sorry that I haven't filmed anything the past couple of days. There's a couple reasons why, which I guess I'll go into. Um, I feel like I haven't felt as peppy wanna be on camera. I got Animal Crossing. That's a big reason as to why. Uh, I've also had some uni work to be getting on with, so I've been doing that. But also, I am moving house. One of my housemates took it upon themselves to start sorting out through their stuff, which is completely fine. Um, I think in part to be prepared, but also in part to keep themselves busy. Uh, so that's kind of been what's been going on in my household, big time, project time. So yeah, I just didn't want to whip the camera out whilst my house is in Bedlam. Today is Friday. Um, I've played a lot of Animal Crossing, uh, but I did go for a walk today and I did film a little bit of it. So I thought I'd make a little, a little montage. <laughs> Of walking. Um, if you watch my Catch 5K videos, I have, there's no, there is nothing, there is nothing like a global pandemic to get you back on your Catch 5K kick. So if you watch those videos, a new one's coming, um, I'm gonna start filming and sort of talking about it and making those videos when I get to a stage where it makes sense as to where I'm up to. Basically I'm floating around week five again. I'm trying to like build my confidence and my strength back up. So that's where I'm at with that. <sighs> I thought I'd like actually stand up. Here's my array of spices. Um, a couple things, if you want some more quarantent, um, you can go listen to my new podcast. Uh, if you don't know, I have a podcast which gets put out monthly. I mean, listen, Gianna and I, who I do my podcast with, we're free as birds right now. <laughs> <laughs> Who knows, we might be making more. Uh, and one thing you might know that I talk about in there is Lambrini, a discovery, a pandemic discovery. Lambrini. So I went to my local corner shop and they were out of rosé and so I don't really know white wine and I only like cold alcohol really so I wouldn't want red wine and I thought, you know what, I haven't had Lambrini in a while and I like a sweet wine as well and I knew this would be sweet. And I'm not wrong, and it's two pounds 20 a bottle, it's vegan, and it's 57 calories per 100 milliliters. So listen, I'm just saying give it a shot. Both my housemates are currently out, so I'm feeling the extra isolation right now. My plans for this evening slash tomorrow is to tidy my room. I it is in dire need of a tidy. And like that's the thing, like when you know that you're moving house, you kind of like, do you want to put everything away? But then now it's just kind of like living on my bedroom floor. So need to sort that out. I should be having a, like a hangout session with some friends tonight, which I'm excited for. So I'm gonna save this glass of wine for that. Should be exciting. So that I am looking forward to. Um, I haven't actually sat down and read since, you know, I was like, oh yeah, I'm totally gonna read. So I think I'm gonna do a lot of reading tomorrow, sitting out on my balcony. Quarantine happy hour. I literally just got the notification for it. 
Um, so I'm gonna be going to quarantine happy hour. I've also got a Sunday brunch planned with two of my friends um, as we're all playing Animal Crossing. So we're gonna all visit each other's towns, be online, just be, have a proper like LAN party. It's, <laughs> it's not a proper LAN party. I'm trying to tell you things that I'm looking forward to. I have been rambling for seven minutes. I promise that something's happened since I last turned the camera on. Other than me drink. I haven't eaten. I'm not... <laughs> I haven't eaten. Yeah, I'm gonna go Skype my friends, which... I'm just feeling really... <laughs> I wanted to film today. P.S. Here's some washing up. Um, I wanted to film today. I wanted to drop in because I know I haven't for the past couple of days. Ugh, so I'm just shutting my iPad. Um, oh my god, I'm holding all the things in my hand. P.S. My room is a fucking state. Let's go. Let's go party. Ooh. Welcome to my boudoir where the magic happens. <laughs> Straight away, I was like, yeah. Go for a Rogan draw. Is that the third gin of the I evening, Katie? Alright, sorry. Twirl on my haters. <laughs> Twirl on my haters. Twirl on my haters. Twirl on my This is a hard look. Good morning. It's Saturday. Um, I'm feeling a little bit more. I think because, yeah, I was just alone in my place last night and like, which I still am now, but I'm feeling better. I feel, I feel like we're all on an emotional roller coaster right now. So I look like an eight year old who has never slept. Uh, anyway, so I'm currently making some coffee. I've got my water boiling there, if that's what you can hear. Uh, and today's order of business is, I need to tidy my room. So I'm gonna do that at some point. I wanna film a video. There's a couple of videos that I've been like, have been like bubbling in my head. And I feel like now is the opportunity to film them. Um, and because the weather's been lovely. Actually, do you know what? It's a little bit grey today, which, you know, it's a blessing and a curse, isn't it? Like, it's really hard to want to stay inside when the weather's so beautiful. Um, but then also, you know, it's nice for the weather to be beautiful. Anyway, so, yeah. So, I am going to film some videos. I'm going to, like, plan out some videos. I've had a little bit of a, a renaissance. <laughs> I look like shit. <laughs> Just gonna put this on the internet, it's fine. Um, but yeah, so I think I might film them in my bedroom because I mentioned as we're moving house, like, a, it, my house is like slowly but surely becoming more and more barren and looking like a, um, a dumping ground basically. But yeah, so I'm gonna have some breakfast, I'm gonna have a coffee, gonna, I keep forgetting that it's Saturday, not Sunday, because it just feels like a Sunday. I need to do that washing up as well, Jesus. Oh, we're almost done. Hang on, I can do this whilst talking to you. Okay, so. <laughs> Okie dokie, we're done. That's over slightly, but that's fine. Um. Okay, yeah, so the order of business today is have a coffee, get ready, sort of chill out. Um, I'm gonna tidy my bedroom because it's in dire need of it. Seeing as we are very much stuck inside, I feel like I should probably to take a little bit more care in my space. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna film some videos uh, and like plan some videos out and sort of also do some uni work. Definitely need to do that. I'll probably play some more Animal Crossing. Let's be, let's be honest here. I don't know, I'm just feeling a lot more peppy than I was last night and nothing's really changed other than I've spoken to some people, spoken to some of my friends. I guess what I'm trying to say is if, if you are on your own currently, I'm, you know, gonna be in the comments so if you want a hangsies you can do but yeah i just feel like i want to get down on paper just a few of the things that i want to film and then i can sort of sort that out really so i have been sat on this video i actually filmed it twice i filmed it the same day that i filmed the last bit of my tassie beauty video so which yeah i uploaded a long time ago but i just didn't like it i knew i was rushing because i knew i was trying to film like two videos at once 
and it just didn't come out how I wanted it to. So I've refilmed it, but I need to like edit it more than what I planned on. Basically, I know once I get into it, it'll be fine, but it's just like, I know it's gonna be a project. So it's gonna be today's project. I'm gonna read, remember? Remember I said on Tuesday that I'm just gonna finish this book. I have not picked it up since, but that's gonna be my plan. Just either sort of late afternoon, doesn't matter what I'm doing. I'll always still have that slump. Um, in the afternoon and so I just definitely think that having another cup of coffee lol and sitting down and reading a book will be hopefully something to combat that because I, I don't want to get into like a bad habit of napping I've been really good at trying not to do that recently so we'll see we'll see anyway I'll see you a little later on 